So in this video, we're going to be talking about natal Virgo moon in the sixth house and what this placement means for you or somebody else if it's in the chart. And with that being said, what the moon represents in astrology is it represents our emotional needs and what gives us security and fulfillment on an emotional level. So also it can show a place that is sensitive and that we defend. And if it's taken away from us, it can cause us to feel insecure. And with that being said, the sign Virgo is all about organization, details, routine, and familiarity. So for the most part, people that have the moon in Virgo in the sixth house have this emotional need for familiarity or predictability, especially when it comes to their routine and to their day-to-day -day lives. And another particular thing about this placement is that when you have it in Virgo and especially the sixth house as well, um, this indicates that you tend to rely on your job as your innermost sense of security because Virgo is all about our routine and our work, our day-to-day -day, um, actions and our, our responsibilities and the tasks that we have to accomplish. So... Um, another trait about these individuals is that they're quite self-reliant. They can be emotional hermits as well. Like they don't um, like their emotions to be necessarily noticed or like they don't like to divulge how they're feeling. They just like to introspect a lot. And as well, since Virgo is about small details and it's about particularities, um, this placement of the moon shows that you have emotional particularities or like very specific things that bother you especially you know the way things are organized and also the way things are structured so um as well you tend to be sensitive to small things that other people are not aware of because virgo is the unconscious of others it's the 12th house from Libra. Um, the 12th is about unconscious and Libra is about others. So that's why Virgos, which is all about detail, orientation, um, especially when the moon is in this sign, they show somebody that's sensitive to things that other people um, don't notice. Now, finally, you have this emotional need for things to be precise or clear, especially so that you can make sense of them. Uh, because Virgo is ruled by Mercury, and Mercury is all about logic. And Virgo is an earth sign, so it's about variables and factors. So people with uh, Moon and Virgo, they like to uh, be aware of all the factors before they c come to conclusions or participate in an idea or an action. Um, and you guys are quite introspective, like I was saying, uh, because also when the Moon is in Virgo, it's in the third sign from its own sign. The third house is about the mind, and it's also ruled by Mercury. So another trait of this uh, placement is that you guys tend to rationalize your emotions or like think about things. But if I really had to sum up this placement as a whole of Moon and Virgo in the sixth house, this indicates somebody that needs uh, a certain routine or structure to their lives, especially in order for them to be able to push forward or to like accomplish things um they they are most caring about being able to keep the ball rolling or like to be able to continue like being productive in their lives um especially because the natural sign that has the sixth house and virgo is aries and aries is all about doing things it's all about action it's all about uh progress and, and um pushing forward so um you guys are very quick when it comes to accomplishing things um, that have this placement, even if some of you guys could be Pisces, um, you guys like to uh, do things in a very direct way. And um, for that, like you have this emotional need for things to be familiar and for things to be organized um, so that you can make sense of them. And um, yeah, so that basically sums up what i wanted to talk about in this video and so i hope this was insightful and that um, it resonated
If it did resonate, then don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to this channel if you'd like to see more content. And other than that, I will talk to you guys sometime soon in another video. Peace. So another thing about this placement is that when you have Moon in Virgo and in the sixth house, both of which are Earth signs and an and Earth house, um, this is double Earth energy. And this indicates that you're somebody that's really grounded into reality. Um, one of your traits is that you are particularly perceptive and like particularly observant. And like you feel small details or like you you feel things like you're sensitive to small changes in your environment. And um, this translates to sight, like you're able to notice things that people don't. And like you're like, like I was saying, you're one of the most grounded people um, in terms of placements, like you're very competent or like um, in, in this reality, like you, you just see everything that matters. And th those are the types of things that um, other people don't really notice. So it's it's an interesting placement because um, you pick up on variables and things that other people do not. But to you, those things like stand out to you. And sometimes people get distracted by things that you don't care about at the same time so like you're really honed in on what really matters and like you have a good bearing on like um reality and on like the details of things so hopefully that made sense and that wasn't too scattered but that is another trait of displacement